Yes, I'm so going to Clash of Clans and today I'm going to be playing some more Clash of Clans for you guys. And I got attacked by a freaking hero who used four lightning spells, four li four spells. Is there serious a tunnel knight? Oh my freaking god! Just self-respect, guy. One doesn't simply. <laughs> Just go into someone's base and bomb their dark elixir when they're above the tunnel 7. Really? You don't do that. Freaking hell. Can't sell those people. But anyways, as you guys might see, I'm in Hail Guts. Because well, we were gonna war but Jake's on vacation now, I think. Yeah, he's on vacation now. So, yeah. We can't war, but I'm still gonna stay until we war because well, I'm kind of enjoying myself, and I also I'm kind of want to change between the two clans and not just well spend all of the time in one. So, well, my base almost done. I've only got one more wizard tower and two more archer towers. I think yeah, two more archer towers to go and then I can do my Teslas and walls but because I only have two, t three Teslas at tunnel 7 I had two but now I had three I can just do walls while I do the Teslas so that's great so the rest of my base is basically max <laughs> let's see this is kind of my progress this is the part which is maxed this is the part which I have to do still well I'm not gonna do these these I they're not maxed but I don't really care these I want them all to level 9 so I can well train more troops <laughs> obviously and also when I'm gonna do raids with special well like alpacas or something I can actually train them but I first want to do them to all all to dragons so I can actually attack with all dragons because now I only have, well, I have one now since today. But before that, I only had <laughs> one uh, train dragon, so that was really horrible. Then I, I, well, basically, the thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upgrade these two, two more levels. I'm gonna get this one to golems. I'm gonna get my Tesla up. This was the tower, these two, and the bombs. And after that I'm just gonna do my walls and I'm done then. Well yeah I'm done enough. I'm then I'm going to tunnel nine. Which I'm super excited about already. I can't wait to get my Archie Queen. But I'm not gonna be talking too long because I'm gonna attack all the multiplayer. Yes I know I have a shield but I don't really care. So I'm gonna be searching for a base and after I find a base I'll see you guys back. I'm kinda interested in right now because well I'm well, I want to get my golems to level 2 and my minions to level 4, so I need quite a lot of the dark elixir. See if we can take out this camp so we can put our troops on this spell factory to see if he has clan cast troops. It doesn't seem like it, but I think I first have to take down this one. And there come the clan cast troops. Always learn clan cast troops when people have full storages. On collector base, of course, you don't have to lure them. But on storage bases, I think about 80% of the storage bases does have them. See, so surround them a little bit like these. And that is quite an overkill, but it's fine. Let's put down a line of barbarians right here. Then a line of archers behind. Archer here, archer here. Just to help me get to 50% if I wouldn't get it else. So I'm gonna be putting down basically all my troops right here now. Let's see if we can put... No. Alright, he only has cannons on this side. I just noticed. Well, about only cannons. So I can take down these buildings very easily. Let's see, surrounding structures are cleared. And now I'm gonna go in with my king. A ton of barbarians, let's hope this works. Sometimes it works really well and sometimes it's just horrible. 
and I just moved up my mouse as if he's such a freaking lad. I couldn't really do much. Heal spell on them. Let's see, will they get it? I think they will, yeah. We should be fine. No, oh luckily it w only went after that one li single lonely minion. And my barbarians and archers will just take down the Dark Lix storage, which basically is what I came for. It wasn't the greatest attack, but it was fine. But anyways, <laughs> yeah, bam, I'd say, because I had a couple means, but it basically was a barge. Isn't the greatest tactic to get to the center of bases, but with a king added to it, it can be quite effective, especially against low level base. Because, well, as you guys also can <laughs> see, that's why maxing your tunnel is so important. This guy was only a tunnel 7 and I already struggled on him. But, well, there, was, there are rust tunnel 8s and 9s and even 10s, which I could get in way easier <laughs> with this kind of army. But this attack, I wasn't too excited for it, but this was like, yeah, basically a rust. Yeah. And this is an example of a rust tunnel. Also, it's a collector base, which makes it easier, but yeah. I really like this raid because, well, I usually have a big of a problem just putting on my minions on the right spots just because, well, yeah, they usually get taken down by the archers but it is a base I really watched very carefully where to put them I prob probably could have done this raid with a lot of test troops but I kind of wanted to get the Dark Leaks from this drill because it was quite a lot actually but as you can see, I've hardly used any troops and I'm already at 40%, 45%. So yeah, if I wouldn't go for the Dark Elixir drill, I probably could have ended it right here. And I wouldn't even have to say, use like half my troops. That's why I really like this raid, because it was really smooth and yeah. Seeming I'm usually <laughs> not the greatest at sparing my troops. And with this one I did it very well, except for this Dark Lake drill. But I was kind of with the raid. So that is it for this video. And if you like the video, guys, leave a comment and like the video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.